Hello, I'm Mal, and welcome back to the ongoing development of games at Malevolent Studios. <laughs> Alright, now, if I recall correctly, the plan was for us to quickly put out a small title, and then as we go to attend uh, the big event, right, uh, the big show, G3, we're then going to be working on a medium game with the thought process that it would release sometime in the third quarter. So that's the plan. Let's take a look at the publishing deals real quick. I guess none of these matter because these are all mature games, so we're not going to mess... Or I'm sorry, not mature, but medium-sized games, and we're not going to mess with these right now. So let's just go ahead and make... Develop a new game. Small. Pick topic. Yeah, here we go. Game dev. Simulation. The Fury Mark III engine? Sure. For everyone, pick a platform. Yeah, we'll do PC. And this will be... Games... Hmm. Well, <laughs> I'm not gonna do Game Dev Tycoon, but we could do... Hmm. Oh my goodness, I'm so bad at this. Studio Runner. <laughs> sure, that works. Why not? I don't know, that's not very gamey though, is it? How about... Here we go. How... To make a game. No. No, no, no. Hmm. Game designer. Oh no, I got it, I got it, I got it. Epic game. Like that. Designer. That might even be a real thing for all I know. <laughs> okay, here we go. Uh, yeah, 2D graphics is fine. Okay, gameplay. Put the engine at halfway. Uh... Do we need character progression? I'm sure. Why not? All right, false fighters. Hey, false fighters sold 577,000. It's not too shabby. Okay, and that looks good. I think we were trying to beat 32 slash 31. Okay, we'll go with a small booth. Yeah, if I remember right, that's what we were trying to do. Oh, are we actually gonna beat it? I think we are. Yeah, because we trained our people. So let's go ahead and release. Ah, I wanted to get another game started before this. Well, that's okay, because at least we'll get, we'll still get the hype boost from that. Oh. Okay, new record. New topic, new combo, level up, nice. Alright, now, develop a new game. Let's do a medium title. Pick topic. Uh... See, it's a, it. I don't get why... I thought we used fantasy already. I'm, I'm almost positive we did, so why... Why isn't there, like, a little number right here indicating that we have? I'm not sure. Wild West? We could try this. Wild West... Action? RPG, great combo. Hey, mature, medium game. Hmm. Dusk. No, 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 can't do that. We could do that, actually. 
Dusk Rider. No, no, no. Uh, Western tough sounding name. <laughs> okay, hold on, hold on. Um, can't use Rolo for something. The Ro Rolo doesn't work for this. We can't do Rolo. Um, hmm. Jeez, I don't know. I, I might, I, you know what? I might just go with Dusk, actually. Or we need something like, yeah, some kind of cowboyish kind of thing. Trouble. Trouble comes. Hmm. No. Damn it. <laughs> I'm so bad at this part. So bad. Okay, how about... Oh, goodness. Western... See, Western, I, I, if it was spacey or something, maybe I could do it, but Western? I... I don't know. Lone... Lone Star Ride. Okay, no, no. <laughs> how about, yeah. Uh, Lone... Lone Wolf? Oh, okay, hey, hold on. Lobo. That sounds good. That'll work. Right? What are you playing this weekend? I'm gonna play me some Lobo. Yeah, that works. <laughs> Let's try that. PC. There we go. But sure. Th hey, this might be a hit for us. This might be a hit for us. How did Epic Game Designer do? Hey! Not bad! What do we got here? Hey, 775 for a, a small title? That works. I'll keep the lights on. Okay, story and quest. Gameplay. About midway. Engine. Nope. Okay, let's see. Story and quests. Jensen, you want to handle that? Why don't you handle that this time? Yeah. And Ida, you handle gameplay. And Garrett, you handle engine. Yeah, let's put it. Let's pull out all the stops here. Yeah. Okay, let's do that. Interesting, got a little hype building. All right, now, dialogue up. Artificial intelligence down. Let's improve the level design a bit. Okay, now I will take dialogues. Jensen, can you grab level design? Good. Actually, level design, I think, actually, I think level design might be tech. Let's have Garrett grab that. Okay, and Ida, you can grab, yeah, AI, there we go. I think the number to beat here was 37, and the number to beat here is 36, I think. So I think we beat it on design there. Okay, design up, graphics down to mid, sound down to bare. Okay. You grab graphics. I'll grab world design. No, Jensen? Hmm. I could have Ida grab this. And... That would give me... Now, I won't make as good a game, but this would give me balance. And I would get my... Uh, good uh, management bonus, which is probably worth it. Yeah, I can just like lower that just a smidge there to 100. OK, let's do that. Oh, somebody to take that. Um, I, I can grab that. That's fine. Oh, 
Oh, wow. Okay, we're going a little crazy here on the design end. And there's a lot of bugs. But we're going to put this out at the... at the right time of the year. Okay, should I hold off a little bit? No, let's release it. New topic, new combo. Good management. Yeah, nice. 1.8 experience bonus. That was really good. Special training available for me. Oh, is that right? Okay, is that boost? Yeah, I can't do that yet. And I don't... I'm not spending a million credits on that. Or a million dollars? Credits. <laughs> I'm not spending a million bucks on that. You're crazy. Okay, let's do uh, let's do some training. So, design for me. Wow, a nine, nice. Ten. Oh wow. Wow, almost a perfect game. I think this is the best score we've had yet. That's gonna make us... Oh, that's gonna be crazy. Okay, let's see. Uh, train... Uh, you need to train on... Your speed some more. And you need to train... Ah, oh, wow, you're just so weak in, in these areas here. Let's go ahead and... Work on your tech. Yep, and you... Your speed's really good now. Uh, research is pretty horrible, so let's work on that a bit, shall we? Wow. Look at our cash. Holy moly. 500,000 in sales. That's pretty awesome. So this is what I normally do when I'm playing this game. I, I I don't do a lot of the publishing deals, even though you're you're really kind of supposed to. Make game history with Lobo. Well done. That's pretty nice. All right, now let's research some new stuff. I'm tempted to get marketing, but I think I'm I, I think we're better served by getting some new topics to use. Motocross? Yeah, I'm not too excited about that. I don't... Did we use mystery yet? I don't think we did. Again, I thought that the little symbol is what indicated whether or not we used a, a title before, and I know we've done post-apocalyptic, so several. So I don't, I don't understand what the deal is there. Not getting what that little symbol, what the number is supposed to mean. Uh, let's see. Um, I'd like to do another adventure game, actually. What would make a good adventure topic? Hmm. Well, let's go ahead and research one of these just to open it up for us. Mining. Okay, I guess like a mining simulator or something. One million in sales. Wow. Okay, generate game report on false fighters. Generate game report on epic game designer. Okay, and let's... Generate a game report on Lobo. Wrestling and action is a great combo. Engine seems to be very important. Okay. Game dev and simulation is a great combo. Graphics seem to be very important. Okay. Let. Why don't you train again, actually? Yep. Tech. Actually, no. Research, right? Because you're like really bad at research. Let's try to fix that a little bit. And you go on vacation, and you go on vacation because it's well deserved. Holy crap! 
16, six over 16 million people? 16 million ducats, that's pretty good. All right, word design seems to be very important. Understood. Okay, so one of my subscribers, Mad King, uh, wants us to build a new game engine. So in order to make that worthwhile, we should research something to put in it. So how about we grab, hmm, animated textures? And maybe day and night cycle? Yeah, let's let's do that. Let's grab that. And let's grab Let's grab day and night cycle. No, let's grab open world. Let's do that. And then what else can we grab? Level editor? Sure. Let's grab that. Just grabbing different things that we can put into the new engine. Mono sound. Okay, sure. Try to balance it out. We don't want it to all be RPG stuff. Now, obviously, we are an RPG studio, but we have built other games, right? 15 million in sales. That was awesome. Off of a game I wasn't even 100% sure about. Gotta love that. Hey, some of the best success stories ever were... Somebody had a hunch and just went for it, and then bam, success, right? It's funny how though success usually is combined with like dedication and hard work. People are like, oh, that person's so lucky, or they're so, they, they just got lucky. It's like, really? Isn't it quite possible that uh, maybe they just worked really hard and they were, you know, kind of smart? Those could be factors too, right? Okay, let's see. Uh, I have five research points left. Hmm, let's look. What's the time of year here? Yeah, let's go ahead and build the new engine. And I have it's been requested that I call the new engine Malverse. Like so. And it was supposed to be Mark, and then it needed to be like a big number. So we're just gonna do like Mark 20. Like so. Because I think that's right. And let's go ahead and add in animated textures. And we'll include the 2D graphic engine too. Why not? Simple quests. We're going to put everything in here. We're going to be using this engine for a little while, I think. So it's going to cost us 420 grand, but this is worth it. We'll, we'll make a lot of new games and uh, yeah, this is this will be worth it. Okay, Ninvento announced their next generation council. The council is called TS64. Okay, we can make some 64 games. Go guys, go! Build it! All right, you go ahead and go on vacation then. Small booth. Okay, uh, we do want to get started on another game. So, what's this? Boss, it's too hot in our office. Heat is starting to impact our work. I've researched air conditioners. Yes, go ahead and get them. Look at that. Nice. Fancy. Okay, popular genre action. Okay, hold on. Let's research topics. Time travel, ooh, that, that time travel action? You think that would work? I don't know. Fantasy action would work. Don't you think? All right, develop a new game. Pick the topic. Fantasy, action. Uh, Fantasy, action, and action is the popular genre right now. We could go for PlayStation. Yeah, let's do it. E for everyone. Fantasy, action, PlayStation, game engine. We'll use the new Malverse engine. Now, what do we call this game?
Call to arms. That's what we're calling it. That's right. Mm-hmm. Fantasy action? Yeah, call to arms. That'll work. I felt you come on board with that. I could feel it. I was like, I was like, are they going to like this? I turned around and looked, and I was like, you were right there with me. I could feel it. <laughs> okay, now let's use... Let's switch to uh, the 3D graphics so that we can start getting some skill in that. Yep. It's nice. We got some breathing room on our resources and stuff now. All right, so let's see. Now, do we want to use all this stuff? No. Okay, gameplay stuff. Yes. Now, who's going to do what? Let's see. I wish I knew definitively if I I I, I think gameplay is design. Oh, I need to look that up, I guess. Engine is tech, so yeah, Garrett, you you keep that, and Jonathan, I guess you take gameplay, and Ida, you take story. I probably should fill this other position. Hmm. Actually, I don't. Uh, I don't think we need to just yet. Oh, we should probably make some games for this now that this is out. Okay, now we're gonna go to G three. Okay, good. It'll give us some hype for our game. Okay, get rid of dialogues. Level editor we do want. That's something new. Actually, no, we don't. We'll we'll save that. We don't need to do that. It, it, you wanna you wanna make a, a good game, but you don't wanna make try to make a great game every time because chances are you're not gonna beat yourself. And we just had that massive hit, so the chances of having an, a, another massive hit right after it, especially in a in a category that you know we're not. This is not a dominant category for our studio. We don't exactly have all the tech to get behind it. So, yeah, we just want to make a, a decent title and move on. So let's see. Do I want to leave this like this? I think I want to spread it out a little bit like that. No, that's tech. Let's let's do it like this. We'll hold Jonathan and myself for the last round. Okay, world design, it doesn't matter. Graphics do and sound does. So we can kick up to the mono sound. Yeah, okay. We'll go up to, like, say there. And do we want animated textures? No, I don't think so. We'll, we'll hold off on that. And I will grab the graphics. Bam, puts me at 100. And... Who wants to take sound design? Jensen? Yeah, Jensen can take it. Okay, that looks good. Yeah, that'll work. This might actually end up being a decent title for us. Ah, let's see. I got word that you're working on a new game. Would you be willing to share? Sure. What decisions go into making a video game and how companies prioritize development? Your new game is fantasy action. Can you tell me... Or can you tell us whether such a game would usually receive more focus on dialogues or engine? Uh, that would be engine, buddy. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. So I'm glad you stopped by. Okay, the interview says engine is of particular importance. Industry professionals agree. Okay, good. Gave us more hype. Okay, this new engine looks like it's paying off. OK, 
Okay, let's go ahead and let's release. Got us a new record. New combo, good management. All right, and then let's immediately let's immediately grab a contract or another game or something. Yeah, let's actually just let's uh yeah, let's find a publishing deal actually. Any topic RPG medium mature on a PC. Yeah, that that's a good idea. Let's do that. Let's accept this contract because we can hit a five and they'll help to, uh, you know, market the game. All right, let's do that. Pick a topic. We're going to do mystery. The Malverse engine. And then what are we going to call this one? Uh, I don't know. I'm actually going to end this one here. So this could potentially be a really good title for us. So let me know what you think name wise and we'll pick it up right uh, right after I get some ideas, some suggestions from you folks, which a lot of them have been great, by the way. So if you like this episode, please consider hitting that thumbs up button. As always, I appreciate your comments and feedback. Thanks so much for watching. And until next time, I am Mal and myself and the rest of Malevolent Studios. We'll see you later.